An off-duty NYPD officer was grazed in the head by a bullet inside her own home, and tonight we are learning the bullet was meant for someone else. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan reports from Long Island. A Brentwood letter carrier steps past a car riddled with bullets, broken glass, near the punctured mailbox. Neighbors who live just south of the Long Island Expressway and quiet Morton Street are on edge. More than 30 shots were fired into the home of NYPD officer Natalie Gomez Iglesias, off duty at the time. And when I heard the pop, 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 pop around midnight or something, I thought it was firecrackers. As a, a police officer, I assume. People might be afraid to come and shoot here. Yeah. Officer Gomez Iglesias, who's been on the force since 2019, was grazed by one of the 33 bullets treated and released at South Shore Hospital in Bayshore. She was not the target, say police sources. Relatives refused comment. I don't want to talk to nobody. Is the police officer okay? Neighbors say the officer lives there with her mother, who was recently hospitalized, along with her sister and often her sister's boyfriend, who allegedly has gang ties. Since they moved there, they really, you know, they're troublemakers. Sources tell us the 23-year-old officer could face disciplinary action for possibly violating a strict NYPD policy, barring members of the force from associating with known criminals or active gang members. For me, I feel like it's more safe when there's a cop living in like your neighborhood. But now Christian worries about retribution, and Dave Escobar says so many children were put at risk. They wish to go back to safer times. We used to have a block party. We know each other. Suffolk police released a statement. Multiple people were inside the home at the time. The investigation has revealed the incident was not random. From Brentwood, Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News.